In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to transfer everything from one iPhone to another. I'm talking about everything, guys, like contacts, pictures, photos, data, apps, and all that. So I'm going to be transferring all the files from this iPhone to this one. This one is the iPhone 14, this one the iPhone 15 Pro. So what I'm going to do, uh, let me go ahead and open the settings on the iPhone 15 Pro, that is the new one. Scroll the way down, let's go ahead and click on General. Scroll the way down until you see transfer or reset iPhone. Let's go ahead and open the setting. So here, let's go ahead and click on erase or content and settings. Then continue before erasing the new iPhone. Sign now from your iCloud account on the iPhone, then erase it. Right, let's wait a few seconds to show you now how to set up the iPhone and transfer everything at the same time. All right, guys, finally, the new iPhone has been erased. What we're gonna do now, let's put the two iPhone together, just like that. And as soon as you unlock the new iPhone, you will see on the old iPhone this window, set up new iPhone. Let's go ahead and click on unlock to continue. Let's type in the password and just wait. Right at the bottom, it says connecting. So let's wait a few seconds until you see this image on the new iPhone. Now, grab your old iPhone and scan this image. Just put it right on the center and just put it together. Let's wait a few seconds. All right, let's go ahead and click on Get Started. So on the new iPhone, let's go ahead and type in the password that you have on your old iPhone. And let's wait. It might take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Let's just wait. All right, pay attention. This is really important right here. So we have this page that says uh, transfer your phone number. So if you want to activate your new iPhone with the service that you have on your old phone, you can just go ahead and click on transfer from another iPhone. Now, if you don't want to activate the new iPhone, so basically you want to just transfer your files from the old phone to the new one, but you don't want to transfer your service, so you want to keep the old phone activated, let's go ahead and click on setup later in settings. So all depends what you want. In my case, I just want to transfer the files, okay? So I'm going to click on setup later in settings. Let's go ahead and click on skip and just wait. So for update, so we want to transfer everything from the old phone to the new one. So we will have to update the software right now. So update now and just wait. Let's go ahead and click on agree and just wait. Downloading software update. So it will take, you know, a little bit, a few minutes. All depends on your internet speed. And the thing is, if you decide to not update your new iPhone right now, you will not be able to transfer all your personal data. So you have to do that no matter what. It's now installing the software. Let's just wait. All right, guys, after that, you will see this page. Now let's go ahead and click on continue. So quick start. Let's go ahead and click on unlock to continue. You will see, you know, the same window on your old iPhone set up a new iPhone. If you don't see that, restart your iPhone, turn it off and turn it back on. Then you will see set up new iPhone. So let's go ahead and click on unlock iPhone. Type in the code, screen code, connecting. Just wait a few seconds until you see the image on the new iPhone. Okay, grab your old iPhone, scan the image. If that doesn't work, just do it manually. Let's go ahead and click on manually and just type in that code. It will be 035349. And let's wait. 
I know now we're going to be able to transfer everything because we, we just updated the software on the new iPhone. Get started. Let's type in the code from the old iPhone. Let's wait a few seconds. So Face ID, set up later. Uh, transfer data from iPhone. You see, now we have the action to transfer up data from the old iPhone. So let's go ahead and click on continue. Setting up your Apple ID. Let's wait. Agree. Make this your new iPhone. Let's go ahead and click on continue. Um, update your iPhone automatically. Let's go ahead and click on continue. Uh, disable location services just for now. Okay, so we can do all that in settings later. All right, as you can see, so now the new phone is installing all the apps that I have on my old iPhone, including my bank apps, as you can see, card are. So this is the good thing about it, guys, that all your cards, basically all the data that your apps, you know, already saved on the old iPhone, it will be transferred over to the new iPhone. So this is something really, really good. Right here, let's go ahead and click on continue. Right here, if you want, you can sign in with your iCloud account, you can do it later. So you can just click on skip this step. You can do that later in settings, skip. Transferring data from iPhone. So all you have to do is just wait, okay? Just make sure both iPhone are close as possible just like that, it says right here, timing remaining about three minutes. All depends on, you know, how much stuff you have on your old iPhone. So it can take up to 30 minutes, one hour. So I don't have a lot of stuff on this iPhone. That's why it's going to be really fast, as you can see. But in your case, it might, you know, you might have to wait one hour, 30 minutes, 40 minutes. Like I said, all depends. Transfer completed. We have everything on the new iPhone already. So let's unlock the new iPhone. So you can see we're going to use the same passcode that we have on the old iPhone. Then right here, continue. Face ID, set up later, in settings, continue, now, now, and boom, as you can see, guys, as you can see, we have, hold on, as you can see, we have all the apps, contacts, and everything on the new iPhone. And that's how you transfer everything from one iPhone to another. And just to make sure, let's compare on both iPhones to see if we have the same pictures. Let me open the gallery. As you can see, same exact pictures on both iPhone. So let's see the, the Apple ID on both iPhones. You see the same Apple ID, all the apps, all the apps on both iPhones. As you can see, you see that all the apps, WhatsApp, YouTube Kids, Translator, TikTok and all that. Please subscribe to the channel, drop a like and I will see you in my next video.